against the Knicks on Sunday night. That dropped them to 7-24. and 24. They have had an awful year. This is the worst record in the NBA. Go back to the It's not good at all. Dang, I didn't even know it was that bad. And I didn't even know I pressed the button until I just turned on the light. Hey, I need to get a shave. I know I'm going to have to do it myself, but I need to shave. I cannot believe I heard that. I did not know the record was that bad. <sighs> oh. There's no games on today. And I woke up early for no reason. Yeah, there was no reason. I When I woke up, I was like, okay. And I felt like I slept, you know, quite a bit. And I was like, okay, well, might as well just stay up. And I figured at some point in time that I'd get a little bit tired, but I didn't. Um, yeah, so here I am. Probably not much today to, to talk about. I, uh, don't have much going on right this second, except for the obvious things, but, um, more or less it's me just thinking about things, but that's neither here nor there until it's, you know, started or anything. So, you know, I'm, I'm just waiting for the spring, summertime to come. I'm gonna be uh, more busy than I am now. Uh, my plan is to not just do it for me, but <laughs> get get both my kids um, into shape a little bit more. Um, can't help my oldest he's already working but you know he's not a flat a fat slob like I was so yeah but I I want to do that at some form or capacity just just to get him started and uh you know then they can take it from there because I it's not possible for me to to get the gains that you know they can get because of them being younger um, that doesn't mean I don't want to try or anything like that. It just, I want them to see and to feel and to know what it's like. And then they can do it, all, you know, the rest of it themselves. So, but the first step is, you know, getting them out there to do it. That, that's not, not saying my kids aren't athletic and aren't, uh, not like they don't do that stuff already it's just they won't do it for me so that's why I'm going to try to get to get them to do it so if you guys are watching this listening to this yes I mean I'm not talking about like you know we're gonna like run five miles a day I ain't doing that uh -uh. and I ain't gonna like watch you run five miles a day that's that's just dumb too but what I can do is go through some drills uh, and since, you know, when you go through drills, you're going at high speed, that's, that's your running right there. We don't need to run. Like, that's going to be the cool thing about it is that, uh, all of it's going to be, uh, pretty, um, high active training, but it's all explosiveness. So it's, it, that's, that's the key ingredient to, to all of it is just explosiveness. And, uh, I want to do that too. Uh, it's going to really help me because I want to increase my vertical. I really do. I really do. My goal <laughs> is to touch the rim. I have not been able to. I've never been able to do it. But I knew when I was younger, I could have before I hurt my knee. I know I could have. I didn't really actually train in it. But <clears throat> I really could. I, I could. I was probably, I would say like three inches from the rim when I was... 14 or 15 something like that it wasn't that far and you know i'm about the same height you know i i have not grown really since 
since that age kind of sucks i wish i would have grew at least you know five more inches would have been nice but it didn't happen uh that's that's another reason why i want to get my kids you know a little, little bit more active hopefully it uh might help them to grow a little bit more i don't know uh but them stretching their muscles is better uh at better at training to, to to give them that um possible option of growing a little bit more that's that's what i want and uh yeah that's what i want too i was saying i want that for them but i want that for myself uh but for me i gotta turn this fat into muscle and uh and i think that's for me it's so much harder just to initially get started it was you know so much harder but now comparably uh to what i was it it is you know a lot different but for me and my kids doing that same thing they might be a little bit tired but i'm going to be gassed so there's there's going to be a big difference they have more of a, an energy pool than I do. So, you know, I'm going to have to take it easy on myself too. Because I got to come to work, you know. That's the only thing that really sucks, I think, with doing anything outside of work. Like, at all. Physical. Like, because I love basketball. Like, I want to go out there and shoot hoops. Or I want to go and uh, have my kids shoot or throw a football or whatever it is. But I want to be out there actually doing it. But... I, I, I can only go right now at least like for a small amount of time until I have to actually stop and be like okay well I gotta tone it down now gotta go sit and it's like really disheartening for me at least but it doesn't stop me from doing it because I know that I have to keep moving uh, gotta stay active regardless of of, of the way I'm feeling um because I know that, you know, there's nothing broken yet. I haven't broken anything. So, and then I know that if I uh, keep going at it, I'm going to get somewhere. Uh, if not a, a good story to tell my, my grandkids, hopefully. If my kids actually have kids when they grow up. Um, I don't know. But yeah. I know I probably just rambled on for a little bit and didn't have much to say, but... That's what I really wanted to say, honestly, I guess. There is, there actually is something else I wanted to say, too. There is there is a demo for a game that I've, I'm kind of excited I want to play. Uh, I'm not even sure how it's going to play, but it seems like it's comparable to some games I've previously played a while back. And uh, if it is exactly like that, I, I'm not going to be really interested in it. But mashing genres and, and games together to create new games is pretty awesome. And that's what this game is doing. Uh, I think it's called Outriders. And uh, the demo comes out on the 25th, I believe. But yeah, I want to play that game. But it's not like I can spend a whole bunch of time or, or anything like that. Uh, even though I wanted to play it. But I'm going to be playing the demo at least because it's free. So, yeah. You guys should try it at least. See what you think. Let me know. Let me get going. Do a little bit of stretching. keep thinking there's more places uh that i could be sharing this stuff on but i don't do it you know i'm 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 pretty lazy on even the amount i'm doing right now like because i know i should be posting more i know i should be doing a lot more than i am um but i don't want to make myself too tired and i'm lazy um but I think this is my style, to be honest. Unless someone else wants to do it for me for free, you know. Uh, <laughs> I mean, eventually I know I'm going to be doing stuff different than I am now. And maybe it might get better. I, I don't know. Um, but I do know that I don't like editing stuff that I think that's supposed to come straight from your brain and heart at the same time. And... And it's supposed to make that melody for people to understand, hear, watch, listen, learn, whatever it is. Um, but yeah. Anyways, I'm going to get going. Peace out.